Wrapping things up, mastering everyday English phrases. Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel where we make learning English fun and easy. Today, we're diving into a common English phrase, to wrap things up. Whether you're in a meeting, finishing a project, or ending a conversation, this phrase is incredibly useful. So, let's unwrap the meaning of, to wrap things up, and see how you can use it in your daily English conversations. To wrap things up, is an idiomatic expression in English. It means to conclude or to bring something to an end. The word, wrap, here isn't about wrapping a gift, but rather, it's a metaphor for bringing various parts together to complete something. Think of it as tying up the loose ends of a conversation or a task. The phrase, to wrap things up, has a literal origin. It comes from the action of wrapping up physical items, like goods or packages, signaling that the process of packing or preparing is complete. Over time, this term evolved metaphorically to represent the conclusion of abstract things, like discussions or events. 1. In meetings, we've covered all the agenda items, so let's wrap things up. 2. In presentations, to wrap things up, I'd like to summarize the key points. 3. In casual conversations, it's getting late, so I think we should wrap things up. Each context uses the phrase slightly differently, but the underlying meaning remains the same. Bringing an activity to a close. When using, to wrap things up, remember, it's typically used in formal or semi-formal situations. Don't confuse it with physically wrapping something. It's used to conclude, not to start or continue a discussion. That's a wrap on, to wrap things up. We hope this video has helped clarify this common English phrase for you. Remember, practicing these phrases in your daily conversations will make you a more fluent and confident English speaker. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more English learning videos. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.